Yo guys, what's going on and welcome to another episode of Shazier Super Bowl. If you guys are new around here and don't know how this works, we have to build our entire team around Ryan Shazier. Now the only way we can earn these players is through packs, which we get based off performance and winning. If you guys want to know the exact rules, you can just pause the video and you can read them to the box to the right. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. Now we do actually have two packs to open up from that last game. Now instead of opening up two gold player packs, we're going to open up one gold premium pack. Uh, oh, we're starting off with an elite. Lamar Miller. Now we do have a running back already in Jordan Howard, though he has been playing pretty bad. So maybe we should start uh, Lamar Miller. But we actually have a formation that uses two running backs, so that's not terrible. This might be the last elite pack for a while, which isn't a good thing because elite packs have just been like pretty much carrying the series. We're gonna get 85 miles Jack. Did my man Dante fall off? He's only a 75 to start the year. I like Miles Jack though. He's a good player. It's not too shabby. So after those packs, here's what the new lineup is looking like. We got Lamar Miller at backup running back. EA, if we could actually pull a left tackle, that'd be great because our offensive line has actually been letting us down. And then over on defense, pulling Miles Jack actually changed a lot for us. So we previously had 87 Justin Houston here. I decided to put Miles Jack there. I then made Justin Houston our starting left end and we moved Demarcus Lawrence from left end to right end. Now before we get on with the rest of the video, I'm super pumped to tell you guys about my sponsor, GM Genius. It's the first fantasy football game that gives out over $20,000 in college scholarships and Amazon gift cards. It's completely free to play and it's been hyped up by the biggest names in sports like ESPN and Yahoo. Now on top of all these amazing winnings they're giving out, you guys can also see how you'll stack up against me by joining my private league. The winner of my league will get an additional $100 Amazon gift card. All you guys got to do is sign up at GM Genius and download the app right now. The first 100 people to join my private league will get a chance at a $25 Amazon gift card. I'll put a link to everything down below in the description. Make sure you guys check it out. I absolutely love what GM Genius is doing and I know you guys will too. Probably the best top three we've got against, but you know, it's not the team, it's the player. Also for this game right here, I will be adding a pack counter. It'll be probably in the top left. I feel like that makes the most sense. Like I said, it's not the team, it's the player. Hopefully I play a heck of a lot better than the last episode. Okay, he's bringing a blitz. We're looking. Oh, no I threw an interception already Looks like we're right back to our old ways. Not really sure what to say. This guy is Michael Vick at quarterback He's going deep the first play. Sandejo's gonna get it back. There we go Pretty much like nothing happened except uh, we're at the three-yard line. Okay, he brought another blitz We're going right across the middle. There we go. Attaboy Cooks. He's hanging on to it That was a big play it makes our life a heck of a lot easier. Okay, brought a blitz We got Jordan Howard wide open across the middle. My man's been struggling, but he's got it going here He's actually gonna break out of two tackles I don't think anyone's gonna catch him. Jordan Howard's got a touchdown. If my man steps up, our team is gonna be so much better. So the Vic he's using is only an 87 overall. I say only, that's still actually pretty good. But we just gotta keep him in the pocket. He's going to Shady McCoy here. TJ Watts bringing him down for a loss. Just gotta contain, gotta keep Vic in the pocket. He's actually getting sacked. That's Justin Houston, that's a good sign to see. All right, here we go. Third and 20, cannot be giving this up. We just gave it up, didn't we? So he actually was short. He did go no huddle, fourth and one. Oh, it's a quarterback draw. That was a good play call. Like, that's ballsy. This guy's O-line is actually doing a decent job holding up. He's going across the middle. It's DeAndre Hopkins again. We went from having this guy to third and 20 to him just marching down the field. Okay, I got Hopkins. You beat even go for it. I want to say that was Sandejo. Usually he's money for us. He's going down the scene. He's got Jerry Rice. That's a touchdown. Third and 18, not ideal to say the least. He's only got one down lineman. Let's see if we can run. Oh, we got some blocks. Come on, Jordan Howard, get to the outside. He's gonna run him over. We're gonna be just short. Let's actually go for this. Big time fourth and two. We're gonna go right back to Howard. He's been playing well. Oh, come on, get out the way. He's gonna pick it up. There we go. I don't know if you guys saw that user stumble recovery, but the boy's got some stick skills. Let's see if we can attack the middle. He is using the D-line. Okay, he's pretty much got everything locked up. Oh, there we go. We got square wide open. Andrew Luck back at it again with the incomplete passes. I'm almost tempted to give it to Jordan Howard. He's been money for us today. We are going to go play action. Oh, we got him right across the middle. Oh, we didn't get rid of it. Brandon Cooks was wide open for a touchdown. He's going to the outside here. Again, dude, he loves DeAndre Hopkins. This is definitely play action. Okay, got to watch the middle. He's got McCoy. He's going out there. Wow. 
He's got a touchdown. That was Jimmy Graham. We got to get at least some points on the board here because this guy does get the ball to start the second half. Just got to play smart. We got Cooks across the middle. Oh, yeah. Come on, Cooks. Come on, Cooks. Keep running. This should be a touchdown. He's actually going to get caught all the way down to the six. He doesn't have the middle covered. We're actually going to take off here. Andrew Luck. He's going to get in there. We're striking right back. Again, he's only got three down line, man. We're just going to keep beating Howard. He's got the spin move. My man's got a first down. He's putting in work today. If he's going to sit in this defense, we should probably just keep running it. We do got one-on-one -on -one in the outside. It's Andrew Luck to Robert Woods. Looking for my man across the middle. There he is. Eric Ebron. He's got another first. We're really starting to get things going now. We're starting to put some serious pressure on this guy. Just got to keep attacking. There we go. We got a good block. Jordan Howard. Another first down. I'm looking for Ebron in the drag here. Okay, doesn't have it covered. Back in the end zone. Oh, Cook's caught it. That's a touchdown. Off the tip. That was such a horrible read. It actually paid off for us. I feel like we've kind of been in the wrong end of a lot of the Madden BS this year, so I don't even feel bad. Oh yeah, we've seen this plenty of times. He's going down the field. Sandejo's gonna get the interception. He's making up for the one he missed earlier. Oh, we got a decent chance at a return here, though that is one extremely fast alignment. All we need to do here is get field goal range. Oh, actually, he brought a run commit. We got Brandon Cooks wide open. And that's going to be game over. This guy is going to end up rage quitting. So that does earn us an extra pack as well. We're going up against another Michael Vick. This time it's an 89. I feel like since you can use training on Michael Vick, pretty much everybody's going to have him. We didn't use this too much in the last game, but I'm going to start using two running backs. We do have Lamar Miller wide open in the flats. He's going to hit him with a nice spin. That should be a first. My dude's got everybody in the box. We do. Oh, Josh Gordon's got a beat. We're going to throw it up to him. A little bit underthrown, but he's still going to catch it. I don't know how much confidence I have running against this defense. We are going to bounce this to the outside. There we go. Jordan Howard, he's just been a beast today. All right, here we go. Going to hit this man with some play action. Oh, back to the end zone. Do we got him? Brandon Cooks got it. Andrew Luck put that in the perfect spot. That might have been our best drive all year. Like, that one was a beauty. This guy's offense is actually stacked. He's got all the weapons. He's going to start off going to Jimmy Graham. He's going with four verts again. He's going to go underneath. That's Leonard Fournette. I'm surprised he didn't fumble that. That was a heck of a hit. Here it comes inside zone. Ooh, that was a pretty good cut. Fournette's just running over everybody. We finally got a chance to get a stop here. Okay, he's going. Oh, he's just running PA crossers. He's trying to run. Get there, Shazier. We're going to end up getting him. He did go no huddle. He might just be running PA crossers again. Yep, that's exactly what he's doing. Oh, got to watch underneath. There it is. I, oh, I thought I was going to get it. Instead, it's Deion Jones. Come on, please bring this back. He's going to end up getting us. Not until we fall over all the way to the 26. We're already in field goal range, so we don't need to do anything crazy. We're going to start off on the ground. Again, Jordan Howard just dragging people. Really no reason to throw it here. We're going to go back with the run. Jordan Howard finding the hole. Oh, keep going. Tell me that's a touchdown. Down at the one. If I was you guys, I would be accusing me of using the flashback Jordan Howard. This is a completely different running back from the last episode. We are passing here. All out blitz. Dude, we had everybody open. If we had like a half a second more, that would have been a touchdown. A little bit disappointing we didn't get in the end zone because we were literally like a foot away. But a field goal is going to put us up 10 to nothing. Zoom action here in quarter number three. This will be taken very short. What just happened? My man just fell out the end zone and we just got a safety. I don't even know how to react to that one. Like, that's a new one for me. If we get a stop here, it's going to be game over. I brought an all-out blitz. He went with the run. He's not even going to get there. Turnover on downs. He was moving the ball at will in like the first quarter. Since then, he really hasn't done anything. Oh, we brought an all-out blitz. We got Cooks across the middle. My dude just tried hit sticking us from behind. Yeah, no way he's catching him. This is going to be a touchdown, and that should be game over. Oh, please throw that. He threw it right at us. We're going to get the interception with Ryan Chazier, and that's pretty much what we were doing. It's just trying to get, like, interceptions with him. I'm not even mad he got the ball back because, like I said earlier, we're just, like, trying to get interceptions with Chazier at this point. He's going to run with Vic again. My dude's got 12 rushes with him. Got to watch underneath. Oh, we got him, Ryan Chazier. Come on. We're going to bring this back for a touchdown. We just earned, what is that? Like four packs on one play? Hopefully this guy just keeps throwing the ball because we're just racking up the packs at this point. Low key, you know what I was thinking? If we get like a complete game shutout, 
We should earn like at least a pack, maybe even two. Never mind. Forget the shutout thing. Considering we played probably like the two best teams we've seen all season, those were probably the two best games we've played all season. Definitely a huge turnaround from the last episode. Now, I know we earned like a bunch of packs in this one, like at least seven or eight. I will open up those to start off the next episode. And of course, if you guys are ready for that, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. Hopefully you enjoyed. And until next time, I will see you later. Peace out.